disciples come up this morning. So how are you all doing this morning? Good. So did any of you uh, try to catch a leprechaun or anything like that? You didn't make any leprechaun traps? Oh, good. So how have you been? It's been a couple weeks since I've gotten to see you. Anything fun or exciting happened in your lives? It's not a bunch today. All right, well, then I'll just ask you a question. If you, well, here, let me start a different way. If you could go any place and visit someplace new, where would you go? Where would you go if you could visit any place new? Or maybe not even a new place. If you could go any place, maybe there you have a place that's really special to you that you go to a lot with your family. What about that? Yes? <laughs> so if you go to a new new place, what's one of the things you do right away? Do you just sit here like this and look at your arms? Huh? Now, my guess is that when you're someplace new, you kind of like to go out and explore the new place that you're at, right? So, for you guys, you just, what, you moved into a new house, right? All right, so, did you just stand at the doorway and just kind of look there, and you've been standing there the whole time? No, I bet you kind of went through, you looked at all of the rooms, tried to find all the little nooks and crannies and places that you could hide, right? And the same thing goes for any place else in the world that we go, you know? Like, if we go to a campground, my guess is that maybe at first we're a little bit shy, we don't want to go too far away from the campsite, but then pretty soon we start going out and we explore all that's around us. Or maybe we go to a playground, and I bet most of you don't just pick one swing and sit there the whole time and just swing on that one swing, do you? No, you go out and you explore all the different toys and things that you can play on, right? Well, in our Bible verses that we're going to read today, that's kind of what the Israelites had to do. They got to go to a place that God was calling them to go to, and they were going to go out and they were going to get to explore this new land, this promised land, okay? And as they went there, they got to be, what? God's people, right? And so what do, what do we do as God's people? Do we say nice words? Do we do nice things for other people? And do we share God with other people? Right? So that's exactly what the, the Israelites had to do in our Bible story today. So I want you to go home this week and I want you to think of a way that you can share God either with your family or maybe some of your friends at school or daycare and um, just kind of see what happens, okay? Can you do that for me? All right, let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we just thank you for these young disciples and we thank you for the work that they're doing in their lives. Lord, we pray that this church will just continue to support and nurture them as they grow in their faith. And Lord, we look forward to the things that they will teach us. Lord, be with them, help them to go out into this world and help them, even at their age, to go out and share your love and your grace and your message with the people around them. Lord, we pray all these things in your Son's name. Amen. All right, you guys can go have a seat.